2002 Acura TL. Yeah. Headlight stock replacement switch. First thing first, raise the steering wheel up pretty high so that you have access to the screws that are underneath it. I think just three screws. All right, now that that's out, this kind of wiggles. And I think it just pries apart. Yeah, maybe now I'll lower it with this little lever. Pull down and then lower it. Maybe I'll leave it loose for now. Yeah, this should just come apart. These two pieces. Well, first let's show them the... Uh, Whoops, there's how loose it is. See, it's loose, it's broken. All right, separated. Can you see it? I just held the top and the bottom and pulled it apart real hard, but you can see there's uh, some clips there. But I just pulled this part and the bottom part right here at the same time and it it worked there's two screws here we have to take out that yeah, are uh, hard to get to. pretty small Phillips yeah this bottom one will, will be kind of hard to get to you have a tool on but, that you? yeah we'll try it to make life easier I turn the steering wheel to get access to these screws now the bottom one is easily accessed so I'll just take those out all right I finally got it out this thing was kind of a, a pain, but it was actually, let me get the camera lit up on it. Hopefully you can see that. All right, so you can see the stock here. It actually pulled out of this, uh, this area, but I don't know what was holding it in exactly. There were these two screws right here and here that were holding it. Then the, uh, top center right above the steering wheel let me get in here there is this hole right here with a screw back in it you can kind of see but I don't know if that had to come out I don't think it had to I'll, I'll let you know at the end but uh basically where is it one second I used this little um very small screwdriver and I stuck it into this hole back in there. And luckily I could hand turn it right back in there. But, uh, cause I thought this whole bracket had to come off at first, but I don't think the whole bracket has to come off. I think you just have to unscrew those two screws and uh, then the stock slides out. As you can see here, this is the stock and uh, basically it's held in, there's tabs on the top of it, and uh, that bracket kind of fits onto these tabs. So because of that, you can't pull it out this way. You have to slide it out to the left. So really just pull hard on it and uh, to the left and it should come out. Make sure to unplug the, uh, the plug first. There's a little clip you push down and pull out the plug and then the whole stock here slides out to the left look at the side without it in and uh, the reason it's so hard to get out there's some residue of glue so I think that they glue it somehow in there so you have to pull pretty hard to get it to come out but now the new one is just going to slide in there like that and uh, you can see there's those slots on the top for the tabs to fit in. Sorry for my fumbling camera there, but there we go. So those tabs fit right in to those slots. And uh, then we'll just put our screws back in and that's about it and plug it back in obviously. 
in the back with this harness. There we go. That had to be loosened. So the These glue. two right here. And then the glue, yeah.